Alright guys, I'm going to show you what I do for a Christmas holiday. And these are my decorations in my new place so you get a peek at how much I love Christmas. And as you can see, I've already been shopping at my favorite store to pick up some last minute gifts because they have the best gifts for the best price. So, come on in. Okay guys, so welcome to my house and I've got my bag. I'm going to put this in my bedroom because I have to wrap them. They are gifts, but I just want to show you how I decorate for Christmas. Most of my items, some of them come from um, Burlington, others I pick up at the home goods store and I got a wonderful skirt. Um, from a company called Nesby and I will put the information down below the skirt is absolutely beautiful and I will show you that but let's take a look so as you can see here's my Christmas tree it is a live tree I absolutely love live trees and this year I had to decorate a little bit less than I normally do because some of my stuff is still in storage, but we got it together. Um, my theme for this tree was just purple because I absolutely love purple. So I have some purple bulbs and I have these gorgeous little ornaments that I got from, um, I believe, Hobby Lobby. They are absolutely beautiful. I try to buy at least a few new ornaments, me and my kids. Well, I only had one with me this year to buy some ornaments each year. So... This year we bought this one right here. This one right here I bought and it just has um, a feeling of dried flowers in it. But I absolutely thought it was pretty so I bought that. And then I got this one. The rest of the ornaments I pretty much had already so I tossed in some green to kind of give it a theme and I tossed these flowers on there. and. That's my live, awesome smelling Christmas tree. And you can see I have a small space here before we were in a huge space, my family room. But I managed to get all of my gifts kind of piled up against the wall. Now I'm a firm believer on themes for Christmas, so. Okay, so. If you notice, I kind of got a theme going on here. I got a lot of red, some white, and I got this little turquoise color. This kind of goes throughout the house. I'm always keen on Christmas themes. I absolutely love them. Um, so this theme is actually embodies those colors. So you can see with my gifts here on the floor, I kind of spreaded them around, but you can see Pretty much the theme continues to go on with the same colors here in the bags. I picked the same colors. So most of the items had that red, that turquoise, and green kind of in them. So I love that since I'm dealing with a small space, I just kind of surrounded everything around the credenza and the tree over to the side. For the credenza, what I've done is I had these little... Christmas trees, which I got on AliExpress. They're super cute. They're super small, but you know, just something little to go. Uh oh, something little to go right there. I got those in gold, silver, and plain. Um, so I just kind of spread those out. I got this little Christmas tree right here. I actually got it from, I believe, um, Goodwill. I got that from Goodwill. I thought it was cute. It was gold. And then I just have my regular little um, candle holders here. I know they're just built with, again, some turquoise little beads. And then these actually Christmas um, 
oh, what is this reindeers I got those at I believe um, home goods they were on sale last year at the end of the year that's the perfect time to buy Christmas stuff everything is on sale and his mama is down here under the tree if you can see that I just hid him right there in the corner reindeers are always getting under trees so that's what I've done there and it's always nice if you have guests over. YouTube has a beautiful fireplace scene. It comes in a lot of different varieties, but when you got music playing, you got the fireplace going, you got the Christmas tree lit, girl, it is time to sit down on your couch and enjoy a hot toddy or a drink or anything. Right here, if you can see it, I have some Bacardi and some nice little red glasses it again goes with the theme of this room and what i've done is i have a little skirt that i normally would put on a mantle i just draped it right over my table and i got some of these little corns and they are dipped in cinnamon so i just use hot water drop these down in there with a lot a lot of cinnamon and Oh, it makes your house smell so good. I actually keep those and redo them every year. Here on my couch, I went ahead and picked up some nice fluffy pillows. I got these at Home Goods as well. I believe they were $16.99 for two. So I just thought that was really, really nice. I just dropped these on my um, couch. The gold kind of goes with the couch color, and the red, of course, goes with the overall theme. And then I found this little cute pillow right here. It was also at Home Goods, and this one was $14.99. I just thought it was really cute. Again, it goes with my theme. It has a little bit of green right here. Christmas tree on top of the card. This is really cute. So when you're decorating, don't forget pillows are your best friend. They make everything nice and cozy. And of course, I have my little fake poinsettias because, yeah, I got a dog and I'm not trying to have poinsettias in the house. But if you have kids or whatever, it's always nice to get a little fake one. This one has seen its best days, but I'm still using it. And I don't have a mantle for my stockings. And I am all about stocking stuffers. I don't care how big my kids get. I am going to give them stocking stuffers. So I just have all of our stockings right here. This is one that's older, as old as my kids. We made this when they were little. And I have hung on to this little freaking thing. I think I got it from the dollar store. And I just had my babies make their own stocking and I don't know where theirs are. They probably, they were filled with stuff so they probably took them up to their rooms and girl, I probably threw them away once I found they probably was under the bed all sticky, whatever, but I still have mine so I still use it at Christmas. I managed to hang on to that and then I have one for my doggy and then one for my kids, each of them, so yeah. And let me take you in the, oh, let's look at this. So this is the skirt I actually got. You can see this is really, really pretty. It's really large. And just look at it. So it has these little um, tabs on the, the back of it. So, and it's actually lined. Look how nice that is. And it's very, very thick. So you just untap it. Put it around your tree and look how much how big that is these are very affordable um, and the shipping is super quick I'm going to put the link down below go check them out you are going to want to get a skirt from them yeah this is just beautiful it's very heavy duty and it's lined so really if you don't like the stripes they got a lot of different colors and designs online so do check them out I am going to put this under my tree. So I'm definitely going to use this. I absolutely love it. So let's go over to the table. Come on, guys. So right here, you're going to see is my little tree I have right here. This one is really pretty. I really love it. 
this little Santa has been around for years as well. I always bring him out. I don't care what I'm doing. I always bring him out and get him seated up because I want him to enjoy Christmas just like us. On this tree right here, I just thought I'd put some pink because I actually love the little snow coming out of it. And then I had these little poinsettia clip-ons. I put that at the bottom. And I got these lights. I need to put new batteries in here. They generally come on at dusk. They have some that do that. And this is another little ornament I picked up at Hobby Lobby. They were pretty cheap. I believe they were like $3.99 or something like that. And then I put my little birds here because... They just look so cute, nestled up in the little tree. So once I got right there, I went ahead and kept that thing. I put pink in there because I really love pink. So here, and let me, let me just go ahead and light my candle. And I got this candle right here. I also got it at Hobby Lobby. It is a Christmas candle and it smells absolutely great. I got that before. Let me just turn on the light so you can see it a little bit better. So here in my Chris, my little table thing, I actually got these um, glasses, these plates a while ago, but it went with my theme, so I just broke them out. I wanted to have a little bit of red over here, so I got some napkins. Um, cloth napkins in red and I went ahead and fanned those out and put them over the plate and if you look right here at the bottom of the plates I have these cute cute little placemats that are actually snowflakes and I got these last year they were on sale at Big Lots for four bucks so I got four of those because I thought I was gonna be in my house but yeah and as you can see right here in the corner it has that same little turquoise, just a little bit darker. And these are actually embroidered, so they are nice quality. I love these snowflakes. And of course, you always have to have your nutmeg. So this is Pennsylvania Dutch eggnog. And yeah, you want to be careful when you're drinking this, but... This is the perfect addition to this little look here. And then, of course, you got your calendar here. I mean, your candle here. And this has two little mittens on it. It actually gives a nice Christmas smell, so I'm actually loving that. And right here, I just have this little Christmas tree made out of actually sticks. And it's painted gold with little items on it. And just to make this look like it's going to be a great, great Christmas decoration, I went ahead and put this little empty box underneath it. And I absolutely think that kind of brings out that silver and white. And it also goes with this beautiful wreath I have over here. So I put this here because I really thought it was cute. Anytime somebody's looking from the... Um, the living room and they're coming over in this area they will see a little bling of Christmas right here and then right here is where my little puppies go this is their tree I picked these bubs up which are made out of leopard print I thought they were absolutely cute I was gonna do my whole tree with them but it was not a thing for this year so I went ahead and put that on their tree they have their own little skirt around their tree because I do put treats out here for them on Christmas Eve and then I lock them in my bedroom so they can't get it. And this is their little reindeer. So that is about, and this basically is just my kitchen here. I, other than putting stuff right there, I don't really do anything else. I just, of course, have all my.
and focus right on it. Yeah, enlarge that. Yeah, now cut it off. Oh, that was quick. <laughs> 